What's up, hockey fans? Paul Bissonnette here, and I'm in the bullpen. Let's go! Checkups fans, what is going on? Busy Boy here. We got the Rear Admiral and Mikey G in the mix. It is your first episode of Chicklets TV in 2024. And guess where we're at? We're in Seattle, Washington for the Winter Classic. The game is being played right there. But before that, a Pink Whitney event at the press box. We're gonna go meet the fans, mingle, and let's get the shinding started in style, baby. And it's Yo! presented by Watson Gloves. How could I forget? Touche, Cadenelle. Touche to Watson Glove and beyond, right, Rear? <laughs> Let's go! What's up, buddy? I'm Paul, man. Great to meet you. What's up, brother? Hey, great to meet you guys. Thanks for coming, man. Our sponsors, Gallo, were nice enough to gift us with 1500 bucks that we're spending on shots and high noons for you guys. So if you're in line, my lovely girl, Jennifer, right here. The pink Whitney. One front person. <laughs> he says that he answers fucking DM on Instagram. Well, you don't have a nice set of tits on you. Uh, here with Dougie Hamilton. I'm here with Pasha. And the only thing to keep in the New Jersey, God damn it, Jesus. Dougie, mix in a water. I know you're on the IR, but hey, I'm over here rehabbing. I'm doing my <laughs> yeah, job. You're working thing. really hard rehabbing. Pasha, thanks for being you. <laughs> Bright and early here in Seattle. We're doing a bunch of stuff today. We got uh, stuff with the NHL. We're doing the dunk tank. We're gonna meet Marshawn Lynch, a sports icon in the Seattle area. A lot of plates spinning right now, but uh, it's gonna be a great day. It's early. Get yeah, my office posture. <laughs> How do I crank this, this guy up? Oh, that's blowing on hot air. So I'm gonna put me toasty. I'm gonna be freezing my balls off. Now, in the meantime, let's check out to Fairmont for my rogues. Now I'm gonna host. So if I can actually get a little bit of privacy. <laughs> Thank you. It's just so weird because the last time I saw 90% of these guys, they were butt chugging out of the Stanley Cup at Hakkasan at like 4 a.m. I mean, look at this. This is incredible. What's up, bro? What's up, Gary? Fizz, what are you wearing? We gotta get you ready for the ball. What do you mean, what am I wearing? Open your eyes. I bought the, this from, from the Fairmont. Thank you very much. Please don't charge my room with that. It's not too bad, isn't it? A little tight on the quads. In the junk. I'll keep it out of there. I didn't take my Cialis this morning. I'm here with Marshawn Lynch. It's a little, little powwow. <laughs> How did you become a Seattle sports owner with the Kraken? Had you ever been to a hockey game? Did you have a favorite player maybe growing up? I mean, I don't know how much you paid attention to it. I mean, well, look, we all, I mean, I'm, I'm no, no idiot to sports, but I played in a softball tournament with, uh, with Reeves. Ryan Reeves. Yeah. He beat me up twice. For real? Oh yeah, he beat the wheels off me. All right, so look, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. So, you know what I mean? I know bro, so, you know what I mean? And he throw hands, okay. and that's all. They like, Boy. he don't use no stick, none of that. He just ride around the ice, or slide around the ice, just fine. He's so, gonna beat you. So, <laughs> so, my bad. So, so <laughs> my bad, bro. <laughs> Thanks that's my dog, though, you feel me? I, I, hey, hey I, I respect it. I don't know if it's a rumor on how you used to get loose for games. Is it true you used to mix Patron and Hennessy? And <laughs> Boy, you just took me on one because I for sure thought you was going to act me like, do I do a stretch or no, something? No, no yoga. Well, that's it. No, nah, the Patron, well, that, that's not no game day type of concoction. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. You, you got certain things for certain things. Like, you know, they got wake and bake. <laughs> then they got get ready for the game, and then they got holidays, birthdays, and I want to get into some gangster shit. Yeah. Then you got that kind of 
Yeah, you know I mean, we can't. You can't be wake and baking on a game day. No, no, you can't be Patricia on a game day. Okay, but the wake and bacon. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it just depends on who you are and how you get out. Yeah, that's true. That's true. yeah. Okay, wow. And I was gonna ask you about what your favorite, most iconic sports moment was, and all my friends talk about the the time you created an earthquake. Yeah. Would right that be here your, in this city? Did, was that your favorite moment that you ever experienced? If you could relive it. I mean, to be honest with you, you know how it is. When you in the moment, you don't understand it, but as the time go and you see what it mean to people, then it's, it's, it's huge. But realistically, because I am getting into another realm of my life, I don't think my biggest sports moment has came because I mean, it's yet to come. Do you, so you think if you won a Stanley Cup, that would probably be one of the top achievements of your life? I mean, you gotta look at it a little, you know what I mean? Black kid from Oakland don't know too much about hockey and, you know what I mean? Ownership in the city where he made an earthquake. Yeah. And then, like, Stanley Cup, like. That's wild. To sit next to a Super Bowl, and I didn't have to hit nobody for it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 solid on my end, fam. <laughs> that, that would be amazing. Now, since you're a sports owner of a hockey team, I was going to throw some terms at you. Now this is hockey <laughs> lingo. I'm sure you guys got your lingo from where you're from. And I was gonna throw some terms at you and see what you think of when I say it. Mm -hmm. So would you know what lighting the lamp is? Lighting the lamp? Yeah. That would mean I just probably rolled a beeler <laughs> and then I sparked that motherfucker. But I didn't have no lighter, so I had to, hey, throw me a flame. Yeah. Same flame, lamp, lighting, yeah. You hit it on the head. That's what I used to do when I was That's a little stressed out. Yeah, when I was, you know, having a hard time stick hand in the puck, and then I'd be out there just doing kind of like you do with those loose hips. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and I did ask you, have you have you skated before? Yeah. And how'd that go? I'm saucy. You're saucy? Oh yeah, I'm saucy. Right. I can do everything. Can you skate Fly backwards? Fish with the badminton. Yeah. Okay. I do everything. From now, surfing to skiing. Okay. All the shit. Um, do you know what a biscuit is? Yeah. It depends <laughs> on where you at. On the ice. Oh, oh, on the ice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're trying to keep everything hockey. Oh, right I, now. oh, yeah, we're back my bad, my bad. Oh, it's all good. You was, you was cool, so I just thought we were shooting. No, they I said like we were shooting too. it. We right. were just hollering. But if I'm on the ice, a biscuit, I would think it was the puck. Nailed it. You nailed it. I'm going to throw another one at you. If you were a hockey player, what position would you want to be? What position would I want to be? You know what? I, would, I thought I would want to be a goalie. But them, I don't think you're that crazy. Nah. I think you're crazy, but I don't think you're that crazy. I would be the, uh, what's the position called? The fighter? That's the goon. I would be that one. I was the goon. Like the goonies. It's like the goonies. Yeah, I would be hey, that Hey, you one. guys. That guy? Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's going to be you. Maybe they could get you in a game at some point. Maybe if they, I mean, Seattle doesn't really even have a fighter. They don't? No, they don't really have a scrapper. Alexiak's a big guy, but he's not really known to drop the mitts. So if they need an enforcer, I mean, you wouldn't go against your boy Reeves, but what you yeah. looking at the time? You busy? Yeah, because we got to go get one. We got to get a fighter. Oh, <laughs> now you're making GM decisions. No, nah, I wouldn't get in the mix like that, but that's that's what I, I mean, because I know I want to hear that glad. The banging, the crashing yeah. and banging. And then you know that. That's how you would do it? Nah, if, hell no. Nah. If you drop the gloves, do you know how to approach a player? Because it's not like a street fight where you stand nah, back you gotta and you can't be sideways or something. Well, what you have to, yeah, so like that. So what you want to do is you want to try to grab the guy's jersey here, right? So, okay, so you already knew to come underneath like yeah, that. Yeah, for what? Yeah. So I, then, I don't see it, because if and you, then sometimes I you just let do, you steal on me. Yeah, and sometimes you can grab the jersey and do the jersey jab where you come out. And then when this guy's got you locked in here, you try to come up for the, the uppercut. uppercut. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Were you aware that they were gonna have Bowie as a mascot before you ended up agreeing to nah. not? That thing's, just, that thing's ugly as hell. I think he's an anarchist. It looks like he robs CVS, doesn't he? <laughs> doesn't he look like a social justice warrior? <laughs> no. Look at, here look, he comes he right now. He's on your line right oh now. Oh my God. Hey, stay on the other side of him. Stay on the other so side of him. Don't come near me. There you go, yeah. Play your tummy sticks, yeah. dab him up, do your thing. <laughs> It's cold. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh you oh, got a chiclet. There you go. He knows the terms now. Yeah, I don't want to oh, touch oh, that. Oh, no. I don't want to catch you in the my <laughs> hepatitis shot, you dirtbag. Yeah. <laughs> you mind if I finish this interview? and? Uh, <laughs> you just squeezed Oh, my you. God. I could smell it from here. Did you, did you catch that? 
Hey, you'd steal everything else from CVS. Maybe some deodorant next time. I think you steal. What does that mean? You're just touching your head. He said his hair and his teeth oh, is fake. It's brutal. Oh. It's brutal. Hair and teeth? Anyway. He says your hair and your teeth fake? No, I got these These four are fake. I got them knocked out in a fight in hockey in the NHL. That we yeah. <laughs> are you done? You good? You good? Can, I, can we have our time to shine here? There you go. Oh, Beat it, buddy. You're not getting any part of ownership. You? Hey. hey. You're oh yeah, you good at this. Hey, I appreciate that, buddy. I appreciate that. What's up, hockey fans? Paul Bissonnette here, and I'm in the bullpen. We're at the Winter Classic, and I'm about to hang out with the Vegas Gold Knights and see who can throw some heat and dunk me the most. Let's go! Nicholas Hag and Keegan Colasar, a couple Stanley Cup champions. Who would like to throw first? Not very soon. One did go. you just throw you three? Uh, I don't know what we were doing there. Four balls for Keegan Colasar. See what we can do here. Whoa! Oh. Oh. I cracked my low back. Oh! Nervous biz? This is some Mickey Mouse stuff right here. That was uneventful. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> That's why we wanted Eichel. Sudden death. That's it. One nothing. The fourth liner takes it home. Well, there you have it. Vegas Gold Knights, Stanley Cup champions. Not much of ball players, but Keegan Colasar, the fourth line scrapper, takes it down one nothing. Nicholas Hag, we need to get you some throwing lessons, buddy. We've got the Kraken going against the Kraken. Jared McCann, Kyler Yamamoto, the local boy. It's a lot sir. harder than it looks. There it is. Yay, pneumonia. You gotta add a little mustard to the plot. Oh, yeah. Wow. This is safety on? Hey, Enjoy. You got know one? I feel like I hit that pretty hard. That's a wrap from the bullpen. That's a fun day of content. We worked our bags off. I actually didn't go through every single new suit, so that last tuxedo, I'll be wearing it for the ball drop. We'll see you tonight. We're going down to Pike Place. I've never walked around Seattle. Yeah, I've never been here. So I'm excited to explore a little bit. We got Rear here. What's up, guys? Rear. We had a fun appearance yeah, last night. On. Wow. Was that place jammed up or what? You know what saved my life this last what night? What saved your life, all right? Well, I looked in vain for miles looking for a place to eat last night after the press box. No. To no avail, you know what? I had a big bag of goldfish, flavor dusted goldfish <laughs> waiting for me at home. And I didn't have to go to bed hungry because of those. So. Hey, <laughs> fill the stomach up. Oh, dude. It, it so you must have chowed down a whole oh, bag? Dude. Oh, it was like crumbs all over me when I got up this morning. Oh, I love yeah. that. I love it. No, I love it. Posh, you, do these look familiar? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. These are the original Watson Glove collaboration with the Spit and Chicklets crew. Even to the point on the leather, we have the Chicklets head embroidered. I've had these things for years, and they are my favorite gloves. I love the color of them. I love the durability of them. I bring them on every single road trip. What was it? The single, uh, the, uh, I just smoked, so my, me my, my memory bank goes out the window. Did you just shoulder that guy? No, right? no, I gave, a, I gave a twist. Oh, I see him. oh you on, did man. the rotation? Yeah, I, got, come nice. on, yeah, I, I got him. Come on, man. What do you think? I know Great I rotation. Him. Boston, but yeah, I, I, that I, joint we had earlier was amazing. Are you afraid either. of heights? I don't like them. I mean, I did things to counter that. Like, I'd go bungee jumping and the roller coaster to the top of the stratosphere. But you still, if I'm still like, we You'll like, go bungee jumping, but you won't lean on a rail. No, dude. I, I did it hoping like that would, like, wouldn't happen anymore. But it's Are you happens. hearing this? Why don't bungee jumping naked, Paul? Are you hearing this? What about this one? You think this? I trust this No, no, this, this, see, this is fine. Like, see, if yeah, I went in the okay. dripper, not a whatever. hotel rail. Yeah. Right. No, no, no. Just like high, yeah, high up. Like, I'm fine. This isn't high, you know? But. Yeah, backwards. No, no, there there you go. Oh, right, baby. Right, Stretch right. that back up. Yeah, way more. Yeah, all right, Pasha. You're not listening. Hey, we're yeah. conquering fears yeah. here. This is nah. great, man. This is great. Yeah. A little go away. Jesus, baby. Hey, hey. Sorry. Hey, a little slump bluster. <laughs> a little slump bluster. I'm not sure what he's talking about yeah, but. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love it. That's a married guy joke. I mean, that's where the view is right there. Oh, yeah, you're going to get my. My new uh, Raya pick. Yo, bring it in, baby. We're here at Pike Place, and we're gonna see, we actually ran into Gary Lawless, legendary Gary Lawless from Winnipeg or around there. Now he's down with the Golden Knights. 
but we're going to see at Pike Place if RA can catch a fish. I didn't know this was something that you could do all the time, but apparently it's a tourist trap. You can do it all the time, and we're going to test if RA still got those mitts because we know we ain't got those basketball skills. Hey, so, so we're tourists and we want to get this guy to catch a fish. Is that a common thing or? Oh yeah, so if you buy a fish, we'll let you do Okay, okay, cool, all right, cool. That's all we want to do, yeah. What's up, buddy? Long time no see, buddy. We're going to get R.A. to catch a, catch a fish here. Yeah, I know, I'm going to watch it. Okay, cool. You don't want to get, oh, here we go, R.A. There we go, you going to catch that bad boy? All right, yeah. This way or that way, like that? All right. Yeah, we're gonna, he's gonna film it. Look at that. What kind I'm of fish is that? Thing, especially with this crowd oh, here, right? Okay, all right, all right. We're bringing that I home to the hotel. Fish, right? Sorry, Pat. Yeah. Go on out. Hey! There you go. That's a nice beat. There you go. Nice toss, buddy. Nice toss. There you go. No, fuck no. Hey, only one reason that happened, yeah. baby. Right here. Lots of gloves. Made it happen. <laughs> hey, hey, pretty good fucking mitts on you, bro. All right, let's get some chow. What's up, gang? Ari here at the Winter Classic. We are with Junior, Ken Griffey Jr. getting ready for a big day. Let's go talk to the folks here, see what they have to say about hockey at the Winter Classic. NHL, worst fan base, who has it? Ooh, probably Los Angeles. The Caps are the worst fan base. Oh, that's gotta be uh, Toronto. I mean, it's hard Hold to up. say right here. Yeah, 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 guy that's, yeah, we can edit I mean, it up. I would too. say Devils. Okay, okay, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I love it, love it. Oh, man, easily St. Louis. Worst fan base, oh, it might be the Habs. Uh, probably the Leafs. Uh, I mean, the Leafs, they're running away. The whole yeah. time they won something, but... Like, uh, Biz, Biz yeah. get off the bandwagon, man. Like, yeah. come on, they're done. Montreal Canadiens, absolutely. Horse fan base, uh, Boston. Flyers, Toronto, just oh. because yep. fucking Toronto. Yep. Um, and as a Canuck yep. fan, an undercover secret Canuck fan here, I, I gotta take a self dig here. Vancouver's pretty bad. Pittsburgh. Bruins fans. Of Bruins the fans, though, they definitely yeah, are annoying. That's, that's, that's what I don't know. From what, all right. Yeah. Really? <laughs> I, I would have to stay Boston. All right, Seattle, we got three major teams here. We got the Seahawks, we got the Kraken, we got the Mariners. Which of those wins the next title for this lovely city of Seattle? It'll be the Kraken. It's gonna be the Kraken. Okay, all right, easy one. So, it's gonna be the Kraken. 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 Sport. Kraken. Kraken, okay. Kraken. Oh, well, not Seahawks. I'm not Seahawks, sorry. <laughs> okay, I'll say Kraken. Kraken, okay. Kraken. 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 Kraken, because I hate the Seahawks. Can I pick none of them? Oh, oh, that's a good one, that's a good one. Um, I don't know. I mean, they're kind of all going through a little bit of a slow patch. Maybe the Kraken? I'm going to say Kraken. Any Kraken. sport. Kraken. Kraken, okay. Great question, all right. Great question. I'm going to go, uh... I'm going to go Mariners. I have to go with the Seattle Kraken. They okay. deserve it. They deserve okay. it for three years Great. now. They've been proving it. that they deserve this, and I deserve to see them be champions. Let's go. We're in Seattle. It's a big decision. Pass or run? Pass or run? Pass. Run. Or run. 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 Okay. Run. You should have ran the damn ball. Oh, pass. Run. Oh, run every time. Pass. pass. Uh, run. Uh, I'm a big pass guy. Pass? All right. Pass, pass or run? Big time pass. Big time pass. Pass or run? Oh, God. You got to pass the damn ball. Okay. All right. <laughs> There you have it. Back to you, Jim. Pass or run? Do you pass or run? We're in Seattle, bro. How many goals will Badan score this year? Oh. Bully, I hear Biz, I hear Biz wants to drive you. Any questions? Anything for Bully? Anything for Biz? Oh, oh, I, I think he, he's looking for nose beers, Biz. He's looking for nose beers. What's up, Chicklets fans? Biz here, down by the set with Wayno, Ace, Liam, and the whole gang. Yans is even in the mix. Uh, not sure where G and RA are. Uh, 
All right, what the hell are you up to right now, buddy? I would imagine that you're probably in one.com. Dude, uh, what, what, how long have you been engaged for? We're not engaged. Oh, we're you're been together, together like seven yeah. years, so we're right, yeah. engaged next year. So, so. I, I'll tell you, like, it's like the best thing you do is like short your, uh, what do you call it? Uh, your bridal power. Don't have a bridal power, yeah. you know? Like, like. Yo, oh, gee, it's Biz. I haven't seen R.A. the entire game. What the hell is he up to? We are here at the Winter Classic and we have run into an incredible coincidence. When we filmed the infamous, awful shooting of Miami and off then, so what, like, what happened, you happened to walk by, so I was filming and like, tell us where you came into the infamous ugliness. Uh, walking to go to Mike's Pastry and I walked by and said, no shit, that's all right. Okay. And I saw that god awful shot. Yeah, we were there live and it was the, it was not edited. It was, that was horrible. Yeah. That was well, the worst thing I've well, ever seen. Sit back, I got, I got five from five coming up on my Insta soon, so. No, you don't. That wraps up another winter classic in the books. Shout out to Seattle and shout out to our great friends at Watson Gloves, baby. Yeah, but it's too baby. Shocker.